Hi, welcome to Broomstick Home Workouts. And today we're going to do some uh, mobility work, stretching, and functional training with the broomstick. Okay, so all the equipment you need is just a PVC, uh, PVC pipe if you have one at home. If not, you just take this one. Yeah, you can find it pretty easily and just unscrew it out. Yeah, well, pretty dusty. Okay, and then we can do all the workout with this one. And for the intensity level, actually it's for everybody, okay? Just get a good stretch, get sweats, and feel good. All right, let's go. All right, let's start with uh, some mobility first. Okay, so what you need to do is grab the broomstick in front of you, and then uh, this is shoulder width apart, right? And then extra two to three uh, step apart, okay? Good, and then separate your legs. Okay, the first one, we're going to do the pass through, okay? So you can raise the stick up, all the way up, up, up. If you feel good, you can pass all the way to the back, okay? If you have shoulder issue or not flexible enough, you can go as far as you can go, stop and return, okay? Deep, take a deep breath in, breathe out, return. Yes, good. And try not to compensate too much with your legs or with your back, okay? Stay as neutral as possible. Yes, good. Breathe in, bring it to the back. Breathe out back. Yes, good. And try to keep your elbow straight all the time, okay? That's the whole point. Get your shoulder mobilized. Yes, let's do two more. Great. Okay, last one. Okay, good. Now I need you to put the stick behind your uh, back, okay? and put it at your upper back position, just behind of your shoulder. Yes, good. And your hands is just slightly relaxed, okay? Good. And this time, we're going to do a good morning stretching, okay? So your feet is uh, uh, hip width apart, okay? And now I need you to send your hip to the back. You can slightly bend your knee, okay? Keep your spine neutral, all the way down, 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 until your upper back is parallel to the ground. And get up. Okay, full extension with your knee and with your hip, okay? It's not a half stand up, okay? Fully stand up, stand tall. All right, let's go. Hip to the back and stand up. Yes, good. If you do it correctly, you should feel the stretching at your butt and the back of your upper leg, your hamstring. Yes, good. When you're doing the stretching, breathe it out. Hip to the back, exhale. And inhale. Yes, good. Exhale and inhale and check your lower back and keep it at a natural curve yes good okay let's do two more okay last one all right so get up so keep your leg tight okay and try not not to move your leg and now we're doing going to do the upper spine twisting side to side okay and try not to compensate with your legs, okay? I only want to do your upper spine, the thoracic spine. Yes, good. Oh, it's a good stretch. Yes, good. And turn your head as well, side to side. Four, three, two. Okay, now slightly bend your knee and we do the side bending, okay? Your stick is still behind off your shoulder, okay? And tilt it to your right. Ooh, good stretch for the side of your core, your oblique. Okay, to the left. Super. Okay, right. Back to the center. And left. Oh, I can hear the cracking in my back. Oh my god. I'm getting over that. <laughs> okay, two more to your right. Yes, try not to move your legs. Okay, now you can hold the stick overhead. Okay, now we do the side bending, okay, with straight arms and feel like you're pushing the stick away from your body. Okay, back to the center, to the left. It's good. Center, take it easy, just a warm up, okay? You don't have to do it quick, just do it correctly. Yes, good. Whew. Breathe out, right, inhale back, left, inhale back, right, inhale back. Yes, good. Whew. Now try to do non-stop at the center. Just go right and left. And four, three, two, one. Okay, good. Wow, the next one is my favorite. Okay, good. So what you should do is, 
uh, put a stick in front of you and overlap your hands and step back a little bit, keep your legs straight, okay? And send your hip to the back, chest to the floor, head down. It's a very good stretch for your arms and for your lats. And try to lengthen the spine at the same time. Imagine you're the lazy cat and doing a stretching, lengthen your spine. Okay, good. Switch your hands. Okay, let's do it again. Hip to the back, chest to the floor. Long exhale. Two more. And last one. Okay, good. Now we do some of our active stretching, okay, for your front chain of the fascia. So hold on your stick, okay, and then open it diagonally to your right and send your left foot to the back. Yes, opening up your, to your body, yeah, good. Back to the center, other side. Oh yeah, good stretch. You feel the stretching from your hands all the way down to your hip and even to the quads, the front of your upper leg. Yes, good. And up, yeah. If you can move your arms further back, oh, good stretch. And four, three, two, one. Okay, good. Next one is a little bit dance movement, okay? <laughs> just a bit, okay, just a grooving. Okay, so separate your legs and then keep it straight. And I need you to roll your chest in and roll down and stick down and then lift your chest and get up, okay? Chest in, roll down and up. Okay, I'm gonna do it relax. Yes, good, head down, chest in, head up, chest up. Yes, good. Keep your arms straight all the time. Okay, last one. Okay, good, other side, ready? Let's go, roll down and up, down, up. Yes, good. Feel the stretching at the back of your leg and then your spine a little bit. Yeah, two and one. Okay, good, super. Okay, last one. So keep your stick in front of you, all right? And get into your sumo squat position so your legs are further apart from each other. Okay, and your feet, your toes are pointing forward. Okay, let's do an inner thigh stretching. Hold on a stick to get the balance and then sit down on your right. Send your hip to the back, knees out. Yes, good, can you feel that? Ooh. Okay, just go as low as you can, okay? Good, combine with the breathing. Stretch and breathe out. Yes, good, and breathe out. Ooh. Okay, two more to go. All right, last one, to the right. Okay, go into a sumo squat position. Yes, good. Your knee and your toes are pointing to the same direction, yeah? Okay, good. Wow, now we look like some sort of like a African tribe, yeah? The African dance. Okay, ready? Let's go stand up and sit down. Stand up and sit down. When you sit down, make sure your knees is going out. Yes, good. Breathe out, up, breathe in, down, super. Up and down, and four, three, two, okay. That's it for the warm up. Let's go into the workout part with the broomstick. All right, let's start with the workout part one, okay? We have three exercises. I will show you first and you follow me, okay? We do the whole thing for three rounds. Okay, good, the first one, we do our overhead lunge, step back and the knees up, okay? So when you step your left leg to the back and bring your arms up in an overhead position, okay? And then bring your knees up, tap on the stick, okay? Ready? Let's go, step back and tap. Switch leg, step back and tap. Switch leg, step back and tap, okay? Alternating with your legs. Step back, tap, step back, tap. Yes, good. Whew. Step back, breathe in, get up, breathe out, okay? Yes, good. if you can sink your knee down, go as low as possible, but don't crush your knee into the floor. It's kind of quite painful, yeah? Yes, get back, get up. Four, three, two, one. Okay, woo, yeah. 
Okay, next one. We do the side squats, okay? So keep your legs together and just drop the stick to the right and you hold it, okay? Back to the center, to the left. Ready? Let's go. Down, center, down, center. And your feet can point out, okay? And also your knee go into the same direction. Yes, good. Down, center. Breathe in, breathe out. Go lower if you can. And remember, check your heels. Keep your heels down. Good. Four, up, three, up, two, up, last one. Okay, wow, a lot of leg works, right? Okay, so put the broomstick at the back, hold it with your hands, and make sure your hands, your palm is facing up. Okay, good. Remember the warm up we did together, the, the good morning. Yes, good. So send your hip to the back, and the lower legs is perpendicular to the floor, okay? Keep it straight. Okay, and then when you're ready, fly your arms up and down. Back to your hip and bring it up again. And squeeze your step below together. Yes, good. Whew. Breathe out, up. And after a while, you should feel your upper back and your tricep, the back of your upper arms. Whew. Yes, good. Breathe in and out. And try not to round your back. Okay, actually, this one is quite difficult to lift the arms up. So, shoulder back, step a little together, lifting your chest. Yes, four, three, two, one. Okay, you ready? So, we go back to the overhead lunge, okay? And this time, we're only doing same side, one side, okay? Left leg ready, go. Step back, knees up, step back. Knees up, yes, good. Extra burn for your standing leg. Down, up, down, up, yes, good. Whew. Super. Four, three, two, one. Okay, other side. And make sure when you step back, don't cross your leg. Okay, keep your legs separate, okay? And the back heels up all the time. Okay, hands up, ready, right leg go, right, knees up, yeah, knees up, yes, good, and focus on your standing leg, when you get up, full extension, okay, squeeze your butt, and put most of your body weight at your front leg, yeah, if you put your body weight at the back, it's like, oh, I'm falling, <laughs> yeah, step back, get up, four, three, Two, one. Okay, good. Side squat. Okay, this time we don't stop at the center. We go directly right to left. Okay, feet together first at the center of the mat. Ready, go. Right and left. Oh, we stay right. So, as a demonstration, show you you got your focus. <laughs> left. Whoopsie. Right. Left. Right, left, no stop at the center, okay? Whew. Inhale, exhale, inhale, yes, good. And stand up with your outside leg, step out and focus on the leg and pump it up. Super. Four, three, two, one. Okay, good. Work on your tricep and up back. Whew. Get ready, come to the back. Fly your arms up, up, down, up, down, up, down. Go a bit faster this time. Yes, yeah, Ooh. yeah. And go, and go, and go, and go. Ready, pulses, lift it up. Yes, pulses, pulses. Bring it up as high as possible. Yes, good, good. Ooh. Wow, it's like a flying bird position, right? And four. Three, two, all right, excellent. Okay, last round to go. Okay, you, if you know me well, if you did all my previous workout, you know each round would get a little bit more challenging and difficult, all right? So this time, overhead lunge, back lunge, and we do two bounces, okay? So we do bounce, bounce up. 
a very explosive and fast get up, okay? If you want to do it slow, you can do it slow. If you want to challenge yourself, follow me. Okay, start with your left leg. Ready? Let's go. One, two, up. One, two, up. One, two, up. Bounce, bounce. Very good. One, two, get up faster. One, two, woo. Three more. Two, one. Okay, ready? Other side, go. One, two, get up. One, two, up. One, two, up. Hold your stick tight, okay? Hold it fast. Yes, good. Five, four, Woo. two more, and last one. Okay, good, wonderful. Okay, for the side squats, I need you to do it as fast as possible, okay? Without dropping the stick like I just did. <laughs> okay, feet together. Ready to your right, right and left, and right and left. It's a quick, fast stepping. Yes, good. Wow, my leg is so long. I'm running out of space. I need a longer band. No, just kidding. I'm super short. Okay. Last four, three, two, one. Okay, last one to go. Good. Send your hip to the back. Extend your arms straight. Okay, lift it up and pulse this. Pulse this. Go, 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 go. Yes, good. You can see that I'm using my upper back and my tricep, yeah? Whew. Keep pumping it up. Go, 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 go. Four, three, two. Okay, great. Let's go into workout part two. All right, broomstick workout part two. Okay, the first exercise, we're going into a sumo squat position, okay? Knees out. Feet are also pointing out, okay? Put a, stick, put, a, put a stick behind of your upper back. Yes, good. Actually, that's how you to open up your chest because usually when people do this exercise, they're hunching the back. So, so the stick at your back can remind you to lift your chest up. Okay, what, what are we going to do now? As a long talking, right? If you're too burning on your legs already. <laughs> okay, good. So we do the side bending to your right and back to the center and left. Back to the center. Easy. Keep your hip low. Okay, ready? Let's go. Right, center. Left. Yes, good. Right, up. Left, up. Okay? Bring it up. Yes, good. And use your side oblique. Okay, squeeze it up. And squeeze. Yes, good. If you can go lower with your hands. So your hands are so low that you can touch your knee. Yes, good. Down. Up, down, up, good. Oh, actually, feel my legs more. Four, center. Three, center. Two, center. Last one. Okay, now we can go down to the max. Okay, good. Now we're going to do a curl up. It's up to you. If you feel not good with your posture, your lower back, you can relax your head, okay? If you want, you can bring your head and shoulder up and then bring the left leg on the floor. Okay, now extend the right leg out and bring it in. Okay, out, in, and try not to touch the stick, okay? And actually, it's a very good indicator because if you start dropping your head and upper back, your knee will hit the stick, okay? So make sure you're pushing the stick up. Yes, good, and draw your belly button in, pressing your lower back down. Super, four, Three, two, one, ready, other side. In, out, in, out. When you extend your legs, make sure you, you don't lose your lower back, okay? If this one is too challenging for you, you can relax your head or you can point your foot up a little bit. It's easier to help you to maintain the tension of your lower back. Yes, yeah, skip out, in, out, in. Four, three, two, one. Okay, good. Now we can face it down, okay? Go into a superman or superwoman position. Yes, good. And then now I need you to do facing down 
and then bring the stick up and down and up and down very slowly about this one okay yes good when you bring it up think about your scapula your shoulder blades squeeze them together and try not to bring the upper body up okay i only want to work on the upper back Whew. and your mobility on your shoulder up down up four three two one super okay it's not too bad right okay you feeling all right yes good okay go into round two so the stick behind your shoulder okay this time we don't stop at the center just go right and left ready go right left right left try not to stand up keep your hip low yes super right left and go and go and go excellent come on come on try to go lower eyes forward find something to look at yes good so you won't feel dizzy four three two okay good stand up shake it off oh my legs okay good so for the curl up okay this time no supporting legs okay so i need you to go into this whole position okay and bring one leg in and out okay and other side alternating ready let's go right out left out right out left yes good when you return fully extend your legs okay and keep your legs together yes if your knee is hitting the stick make sure you're pushing the stick up okay Whew. in out wow this one is burning on my six pack in out and four three two one okay good let's row up okay okay on your front okay this time i need you to lift your legs up at the same time okay up relax up but your head is still facing down keep your spine neutral yes good up down up down very good Ooh. feel the whole back strengthen your back muscles yes good and try not to bend your elbows okay keep it straight and extend it and four three two one okay excellent wow that's quick okay last one last round to go okay good sit into your sumo squat position okay this time we need to go a little bit extra okay so what we're going to do is side bending and then stand up straighten your legs okay alternating switch side okay let's go stand up left stand up right stand up left stand up yes right up fully extend your legs come on this round you can stand up okay yes get all the way up Whew. down up keep going keep going yes good and try to squat lower work on the inner thigh at the same time also feeling your butt and feel your oblique and four and three and two and one okay good well go for the tough one for your core you ready okay curl up first okay go into your whole position okay if you don't want to do this one you can put one leg down all right ready this time we only focus on one side right leg in and out and in and out Whew. when you bring it in breathe out go yes five more five four three two one other side switch yes good control your leg fully extend the knee yes good keep pushing the stick up to the sky okay five four three 
two, and one. Okay, oh my God. All right, good. Superman time. Okay, get down to your belly. Okay, I need you to do something extra this time, okay? I need you to keep kicking with your butts, but keep your legs straight so it's not like a, yeah, this kind of swimming pool kicking, okay? Knees up and kick, engage your butts. And then at the same time, you're moving your arms up and down, just like the first two rounds. Ready? Let's go. Up and down and up and down. Yes, good. Multitasking. Training your upper back and your glutes at the same time. Buy one, get one, three. Yes, good, good deal. Up, down, up, down. Come on, give me four more. Four, three, keep your knees up. Two, and one. Okay, Woo. This is it for the broomstick workouts. Okay, well done guys. So see you in the next workout videos, okay? Bye.